So how you talk matters. Um, the things you say to yourself internally or externally or the language you're using with other people, all this stuff has an influence on your life. Um, quick example here of what I'm trying to get at today is, you know, saying things like, I'm tired. You know, we've all felt tired before, uh, but, and, you know, maybe some more than others. But if you start saying things like, I'm tired, or, you know, I'm out of shape, or I'm weak, whatever, we'll stick with tired for this example. You say, I'm tired, you're basically telling your body and your mind that it, it's all over for now. We're tired, I'm tired, my mind's tired, and you're taking it all on. Instead of doing that, play around with your words a little bit, because again, they really have an impact of saying things like, I'm feeling tired. So it's a feeling. It's, not, it's something that you can navigate a little bit better. You're not 100% enveloped by it. Even better is in your language, um, already kind of uh, proactively providing a solution for it. So instead of saying, I'm tired, maybe the worst way to say it, or I'm feeling tired, maybe propose a solution. If you're feeling tired, like, I need to take some rest or um, I need to find a way to, to, to energize, to get my energy up. Uh, these things really have an impact, again, on, on things you're gonna achieve or just in general in life, right? Uh, if you've ever trained with me or lifted weights with me at the gym here, um, you'll notice that I do not encourage you to say things like, man, that feels heavy. If you've lifted with me, I'm gonna tell you to stop it right there. Say things like strong. Of strong, even even just in your head, strong. Repeating the word strong. Don't ever let the words heavy creep into a strength training workout. It really is a big deal, um, and your language influences uh, your actions. And you know, there's a reason, and it's not just a Facebook meme, right? It's the there's a reason that it's thoughts go to words and words go to action. So keep all this stuff not just positive, um, but in a way that you're not just always taking on the way you're feeling. Um, that you know you're you're not letting like you know circumstances push you around having a little bit of like a bird's eye view of this stuff um, and playing around with this stuff to let it let your language support you and not detract from what you're trying to do have a good one guys